Hi everyone, welcome back to an episode of D Gaming featuring Yu-Gi-Oh! Dueling. I am still waiting for Konami to release the main box, which is supposed to be today. So do stay tuned for a video that I will be doing unpacking and more in-depth review on that. If you still do not know what is the main box about, do check in my video. In the uh, end of the video, I will put a top right corner for the link to that video. So do stay tuned on it. But let's move on to today's topic. As promised in yesterday's video, I'll be talking about Akana because I promised you guys that I will be milling him, grinding him to get level 40 and it takes, I, I would say, half a day to do that. So basically, I'm proud to present to you the full build of this deck. I hope you guys like it. Do leave a comment down below on any other decks you like me to feature. Remember to subscribe and follow me for, on my Facebook for more updates and upload. So basically, this is a DM DMG combo. So a lot of people may ask for a new player what is DM. DM stands for Dark Magician and DMG stands for Dark Magician Gear. So I'm using the Field Skill Master of Magician. For those who do not know, this gear is basically can be used after a life point decreased by 2000, randomly at 1009 Dark Magic Attack or Dark Magic Expanded to your hand. This gear can only be used once per duel. So basically, this allows you to get additional card from external space. It won't be retrieved from a deck, so no worry about that. It will just give you more surprise. Basically, you'll be looking for Dark Magic Attack or Dark Magic Expander Thousand Knife. Mm, yes and no. So let's move on to the dark, the playlist. We have three Dark Magician Girl for its own effect because we are still building around Dark Magician Girl to have an easy summon of. Dark Magician in the video you will take a look on that. So moving on, on the next card is Skill Dark Magician. We will be not we will be not talking about most of its effect in this video, but its 1900 attack presence on the field sometimes will allows you to stall for one turn because you will need your combo right before you can OTK your opponent. We have one Legion of Fear Jester because if this guy removed from the field to the graveyard, you can basically add one Dark Magician to your hand. So pretty OP in that. And it's another effect is that if it's normal summon this turn, I can do an additional normal summon for Dark Magician to have an easy access of Dark Magician. So moving on, we have two new acquisition into the Dark Magician family. It's called Magician Rod. So basically this card is all about when it's normal summon, I can add one Dark Spell or Trap card which have Dark Magician listed on it. So basically, we are looking to mirror out Dark Magic Attack that can allow us to destroy all spell and trap cards by opponent control and Sage Stone because if I control face up Dark Magician Girl, I can special one special summon one Dark Magician from your hand or deck to the field. So pretty OP on that. And we can also mirror out Dark Magic Curtain and this, this spell card is very good and special because all I need to do is pay half your life point, special summon one Dark Magician from a deck. Remember, it's only from a deck. So if you run out of Dark Magician in your deck, sorry, this card is useless. So use it within your mains. And next, the two cards we're gonna use is Thousand Knife. So basically, this guy just target one monster my opponent control and destroy the target. So the spell card is pretty much like this. And the core of this card is Dark Magician. So how do we summon up Dark Magician? By two ways. Muslim, we have three of them to do a uh, normal summon or by stage stone. So without further ado, let's move on to the highlight. I hope you guys will enjoy this. I would say this deck is pr pr pretty fun with all the combos there. So I hope you guys have success and have fun before the PvP restart tomorrow. So first game, Akana vs Yan Mi Yuki. I've stolen his Dark Magician. I hope he's not crying on it. He's using a Balance Gear. I have a pretty good hand. I have Magician Rod, Dark Magician, Thousand Knife, and Dark Magic Attack. Basically, I'm just about how I summon Dark Magician on the field. So now I use Dark Magician, uh, I mean Magician Rod, to mirror out Sage Stone just for the storing turn. So I try to attack and it's against the Galliator deck. Let's see if this deck is good enough against a top tier deck. 
So Lakari is out on the field and it's his turn. He's going for the attack, damaging myself. I need to get that magician out. And let's go on the heart of the card. And we got Muslim. And we special summon Dark Magician on the field. And use Dark Magic Attack. And Master Magician. And we have this guy now. Okay, let's talk about Dark Magic Expander. So basically, this card is uh, I mean, a card from the alien. We don't have access as of now. So if we get this, what is this card all about? Apply this effect in sequence based on the numbers of Dark Magician and all Dark Magician girl on the field. If I have one Dark Magician, I mean Dark Magic family, I can, on this turn, I can target one Spellcaster monster and gain 1000 attack until the end of the turn. If I have two Dark Magic family on the field, my opponent cannot activate cards and effect in response to your Spell Trap card or effect activation. Also, Spell Trap card you control cannot be destroyed by your opponent card effect. So basically, it allows uh, your Dark Magician to be have a smooth sailing attack for this turn because your opponent can't activate anything from their field. And if we have 3 plus Dark Magician, which means we have 3 Dark Magician or I mean semi Dark Magician and Magician Girl, our, mon our spell, cast spell Caster monster I currently control are unaffected by any opponent card effect until the end of the turn. So basically, you have three of them, you will have the sequence of the effects 1 plus, 2 plus, and 3 plus. So pretty OP. So he surrender. Easy peasy, like a cheesy hazy. This card is about more, about more destruction and. You need to pretty much knock out your opponent very fast. If the combo is always, I would say, is still smooth sailing as of now, um, carry on to a new deck to just focus on Dark Magician. It will be out tomorrow, so stay tuned on it. I hope you guys will like that video as well. So, Fear of the Warrior. I have a fear spell of my own. Mazulam, get Dark Magician gear out. I just set a spell card just for you know shenanigans purposes Mazulam again get out Dark Magician Master Magicians and I have the expand Dark Magic Expander get my Dark Magician up to 3000 fire attack 1000 knife all the combo in turn 3 and the knockout easy like a cheesy if you can get a combo card like what I did, it's so it's so cheesy. This deck is very fun, it's pretty fast, it's pretty disastrous and destructible. And we are against a mind scan Pegasus. Let's see how we fare against this Pegasus with our Akana crown. So we start off with a uh, skilled Dark Magician, just you know, holding on there for his effect, and it's against a uh, Cyber Angel deck. Let's see who has the better combo here. So I Mazulam, get out my Dark Magician gear and Sage Stone to call out my Dark Magician, and go for the OTK. So I has a laugh laugh against Cyber Angel. Pretty pretty awesome win. I know you guys is yelling for Magic Curtain replay. I do believe this replay feature Magic Curtain. If not, will be the last one. So I hope you guys like this. But Magic Curtain will be more for tomorrow video because that video. I will not have six stone help, so basically it's magic curtain there. So I open up with, I mean, pretty brick hand. So I just use Legion and I'm playing against a ghost trick deck. A lot of shenanigans going on, so I use magic rod. And he spirit barry barry me, and I get stick six stone because I need to do a normal summon out to KO him this turn. So Dark Magician Girl is out. I use Legion, uh, Legion the Fiend Jester effect 
and Sage Stone to meet out another Dark Magician. Let's see the very beautiful animation summoning. If you successful normal summon him a hundred times, I believe you will get a map or a gain sleep. So have fun doing that. Thousand nine. Destroy. Thousand nine. Destroy. So he has no friend roll. Just go for him directly. Easy peasy win. So this will be the last replay of today. I hope you guys like it. And it's against another young Yuki deck. It's always go going good going on second turn because you have more time to prepare your attack. So it's against another Cyber Angel. So a lot of cyber angel shenanigans here. My turn. I use magic rod. Get the dark magic curtain out. I can't I can't use dark magic curtain on this turn because I have already summoned a monster. So do take note of that. So now he uses a machine assembled ritual to get bikini out. And I survive this turn, which is his Downfall. So I'm gonna use my Dark Magic Curtain to special summon one Dark Magician from my deck and Master of Magician. And I get two Dark Magic attack, but I thousand knife him pretty easy. I just set few cards here just to serve as a back row. And now I have Skill Magician out, but he has no resistance against my Dark Magician combo. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, have a good day, good afternoon, good night, signing off and peace.